What's up everybody, it's your boy True back at it again with another video and this time we're gonna go through every Ivy Park Ultra Boost ever released, ever created. I have them all and uh, it's quite a bit. Uh, so uh, I did a video last time with all the latest ones so I picked up a couple of more so this is the latest update uh, with all of the Beyonce Ivy Park Ultra Boost. So let's jump into it. Uh, as you know, Beyonce has a collab with Adidas. The name of the brand is Ivy Park, and she's been dropping things consistently since 2020. Um, and it's been quite a bit of things. Uh, the releases have been kind of spread out. Some of them were kind of close, but some of them are spread out. So we're gonna go through them all with dates and everything. And uh, you know, let me know what y'all think. So first off, the first collection uh, was the 2020 collection. And that was the maroon and solar orange. This was the first one. Whenever I saw it, I was like, I definitely wanted these. I just love the color of the maroon and the solar orange. I thought it was nice and creative. Uh, I thought it was real dope. So when I got these, when I saw these were coming out, I ended up grabbing them. I didn't get them to release. I think these I ended up getting off of GOAT. Uh, GOAT or StockX. I don't remember. I think maybe StockX I used for this one. Uh, excuse me. So this was the first release. Uh, the collection was called the 2020 collection. And it was released January 18th. 2020. After that, the second pair were the, uh, I guess these are the high res and gum. Uh, these were released October 30th, 2020, and they were part of the fall capsule. So that was the name of that particular lineup, the fall capsule. Uh, so I love Volt shoes. I don't have a lot of Volt shoes and I was looking to get some high res Volt shoes. So when these came out, I was like, no brainer, I'm going to get these. <laughs> so I ended up getting my second pair and uh, that's how I ended up picking these up. So after these, the third pair came out. So the third pair is the Core Black. So the Core Black and it has the little, um, I guess, high res at the bottom. I saw that and I'm like, oh, I gotta get these. <laughs> I love all black. And then just the little hint of the green at the bottom. I'm like, yo, those are super dope. Gotta grab these. So this was part of the Drip 2.2 collection. Um, the collection before was kind of the 2.0. Um, that was like another name for this particular collection. So then they dropped the Drip 2.2, which was released November 19th, 2020. So these were released fairly close to each other, actually. Um, and I think that's why they just did it, called it the Drip 2.2. Um, of course, the all black with the Ivy Park tag. Uh, but yeah, I saw these, I was like, yo, gotta get them. So at this point, I have three pairs. And then uh, the next pair drops which is part of the Icy Park collection. So the Icy Park was a winter collection. Uh, it was released February 19th, 2021, uh, and it was just all white. So all white was kind of the original Ultra Boost that kind of got them going. If you remember seeing Beyonce and Kanye West, I want to say that they were rocking the all white ones. Um, so yeah, I don't know, I just kind of picked it up. I didn't have a lot of all white shoes. A lot of people wear all white Air Forces. I'm not a big all white Air Force guy, so I ended up grabbing these. And then I love the gum. White and gum looks real good to me. So this was the Icy Park, February 19th, 2021. So then after that, uh, I kind of was done. I wasn't going to do any more and I stopped. I had these four. I'm like, I'm good. You know, I'm not really collecting these. These are the ones I wanted and then I stopped. So that happened and then another pair came out. Uh, <laughs> So the Rodeo, which actually had two pairs that could come out, maybe, and this is the Acid Orange. Both of these released the same day. So this was the Rodeo collection, August 20th, 2021. I didn't even get these when they came out. I wasn't interested in getting them. I wasn't going to get them, and I didn't. Um, so I ended up wanting some Navy shoes as beaters or whatever. So I started looking at Navy shoes and I was between 250 and 300 that I was looking for is something nice. So I was like, well, let me take a look at these. I looked these up well below retail. Um, I want to say I paid $110 for these or something like that. Um, I don't remember the exact price, but I'll have it probably posted up. And these were on sale too. So I ended up getting both of these brand new for the price of what I would have paid for just one. So I was like, well, I like the loud color, the acid orange. So I ended up getting both of them. So at this point, now I have like the entire collection. Uh, even though these were two pairs that I didn't plan on getting, I just ended up getting them. Um, August 20th, 2021, these were the Rodeo collection. And then when I was out the country, uh, a Peloton collection come out and Olive Green. Olive Green always looks real good on a shoe, on just about everything. So these were released and on November 11th, 
2021. I was actually in Israel. I was trying to get these when I was in Israel. Uh, they kept declining, thinking that I was out the country, like trying to, you know, some fraud type stuff. So I ended up having to go and get these off of GOAT. Um, StockX didn't have them, so I went on GOAT. GOAT had them, Peloton Collection. Um, I don't even think Beyonce wore these in any marketing. It was just all the instructors for the Peloton. Uh, so yeah, I ended up grabbing these, and as you can tell, the collection is still going. So, the next two pair, I saw, I saw at this point, I'm like, I'm done. And then two more pair come out. Uh, one pair comes out and I bought it, but the next pair I bought, but I returned it immediately. Not returned it, but I canceled the order. And this is why. So this is the next pair. This is the Ivy Park Halls of Ivy collection. Uh, this was the collection when everybody was on campus. Uh, and that was kind of like the look and stuff. Uh, solar green, signal green, that's the two colors that are described for these. Um, these came out December 10th, 2021. So the reason why I didn't get them, because on the back it says Ultra Boost. All of the other pair say Ivy Park on the back. All of the heels have Ivy Park, Ivy Park, Ivy Park. So I was like, well, I don't know if this is like a real Ivy Park collab because it just says Ultra Boost and the other ones say Ivy Park. So I didn't get them. That's why I sent them back. Even though they have the little uh, tag on it, uh, the insole says Ivy Park. To me, just this saying Ultra Boost was kind of funny to me and that's what made me pass on. So uh, I ended up returning them or canceling them. And then uh, people started commenting on the video about how you know it's cool that you're collecting, continue to collect them. So I ended up doubling back, getting these. I actually paid a way less under retail. I want to say like 150, 140 or something like that. And then of course a new pair comes out, which is the latest. Ivy Heart, the Heart Collection. These came out February 9th, 2022. Valentine's Day with the Shock Pink. Uh, since I'm collecting them, it seems now, I just grabbed them. These have a little more detail. They have Ivy uh, on, right here under the laces before the toe box. Uh, have a little silver. So these, they're getting a little more creative with them. Um, got these also resale. So far, these the value of them don't hold up. I would never suggest buying these retail. I would just say wait and get them either on StockX or um, GOAT. Majority of these I bought uh, resale and all of them that I bought resale, I paid well under retail for. So um, this is it. This is the entire collection. The boxes, obviously this is a pink box. This one actually came with a brown box to kind of cover it. Um, so they're kind of stepping it up. This is the latest period that came out for February. First release of the 2022 year. And this is the box, of course, for this one. All of the boxes have the similar color. If you look at the old video, I show all of the boxes. But this is it, man. This is the entire collection. Every Ivy Park Ultra Boost that's ever been released, I have. And it seems I'm going to kind of, I guess, keep the trend going of getting them. Um, trying to grab them and hold them up as, <laughs> as you kind of see the recap. But, uh... <laughs> this is it. This is where we're at, man. Ivy Park, Ultra Boost, uh, MKTP. Uh, make sure y'all like, subscribe. More videos coming soon. Hopefully y'all enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think about the collection in the comments. Let me know what pair you feel are the favorites. Um, you know, let's just talk about it, man. That's all I got. It's your boy, True. Peace.